good morning everybody low wolf rick here and it is currently 8 a.m here on the las vegas strip you see the road construction here is in full force currently 80 degrees for the strip it's a really nice morning this morning it's supposed to get up to like 93 degrees today it's projected high so it is uh gonna be a nice day a couple of ticks uh, less than yesterday as it got up to 98 was the high that i saw uh, yesterday so uh, be a few degrees cooler but still 93 degrees is uh, way above average we're waiting for the light to change we see this police officer out here directing traffic as it's got uh, see everything's kind of goofed up here hope everybody's ready for the weekend They ran over one of the pylons there. So what's on everybody's agenda for this weekend? Everybody gonna have like a, uh, got the barbecues out and cleaned already and ready to go. Hopefully that's the, uh, that's the plan for a lot of people this weekend, especially around here. It's just supposed to be in the uh, mid to upper 90s all weekend. And, and as they say at Toy Story, to infinity and beyond. At least for the next 10 days forecast shows, it's like the temperatures are supposed to be in the 90s. Everybody out of here enjoyed a nice uh, early morning breakfast here. This patio seating here at the Alexis. Maybe we'll come up here and we'll see how the uh, construction is progressing here in front of the uh, Horseshoe Hotel. Does everybody get used to calling it the horseshoe yeah, yet?
take a look back where we came from here to the cosmopolitan Bellagio. Has any of my viewers seen that the uh, the Medford yet? The uh, Martha Stewart restaurant inside the Paris Hotel. I read a. Uh, I was reading something on the internet that I came across her name. She's 81 years old. You know, and I don't know if it's just because it's like it seems like she's been around forever, whatever. It seems like she should be older than that, you know. moving around all of these uh, storefronts that are going to be staying open. Yeah. This place here is like now the uh, sells tickets and stuff. It used to be a coffee, uh, coffee place. I would imagine if they get them all moved around, though, it'll probably uh, fill them all up because there were some empty spaces here. You know, one of my bucket list things to do has always been to go to up to Vermont and visit a town where Ben and Jerry's is at. You know? That's, uh, I've seen pictures, I've seen some videos. It's like, looks like it would be a fun, uh, a fun trip, fun, you know, just going through that whole area of Vermont, but uh, especially visiting that town.
think I was sort of ordered the last time I came through here. Take a look here northbound on the strip. See that construction to do it here. That's where Blake Shelton's uh, bar and restaurant is going to be, right in this area, right up front here. Take a look at all those tracks and everything. And the things that makes the fountain go. Starbucks down there. We kind of cut the cross here. This little edge of the Bellagio here going back down as we head back south out here along the strip by the uh, the lake out here. Seems like it's a little bit more humid today than it has been too. Now they had said earlier, you know, with the temperatures going up and stuff, there's always that chance of afternoon thunderstorms that we used to get around here. It's like in the Las Vegas area, but uh, you know, it's been clouds come and go a little bit. It's like you know, throughout the day, but so far there hasn't been any real. Any real rain or anything, so. I'm sure it's like that's going to make all this traffic go a little faster there. But you know, as long as it makes him feel better, that's the main thing, I guess, huh? It's like Burke said, it's like at the Shawshank Redemption. People done got and get themselves in the whole big hurry or something like that. Because when he went to prison, there was like a, 
It was horses. The second he gets out, there's cars. Okay, we'll just kind of cruise around here for another minute or so and we'll wrap this up. I hope everybody does have a great weekend. If you're new to the channel, please hit that uh, thumbs up button. That helps us out a lot. Helps keep the video visible in a YouTube universe. And I appreciate everybody watching. Everybody take care, okay? Stay healthy. Have a great weekend, but I'll see you in the next video. Hey, bye-bye, everybody.